Hello Pisces, welcome to Brutally True Tarot and this is your reading from 25th of June to 1st of July. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Pisces. For this week. The Devil. Sun in reverse, Ten of Swords, Four of Wands in reverse. And Eight of Wands. Okay, here we have Eight of Wands. Looks like you are in a new relationship. Or maybe there is someone new around you who is showing a lot of interest and who is charming. But then you need to be very careful with what you choose. Here you have the card of the devil. Looks like you are unconscious right now. I mean, you are unaware of your subconscious feeling. Your, um, your eyes are closed and you cannot see the reality for what it is. You know, and maybe you are not seeing the dark side of this person. And they are taking advantage of that. This person knows that you love them, you are attracted to them and they are showing you the things that you want to see because they know that you are not going to doubt them. Okay, and then here you have the card of the sun in reverse. With the card of the sun in reverse, this person might disappoint you. Maybe you are expecting something from them and uh, they will show their true colors in the end. This person is trying hard to be nice, but they cannot because, you know, time is going to put a test for them and they will have to face it. And then here you have 10 of swords. Okay, so it looks like your eyes will open and you will panic all of a sudden, seeing that, okay, where I am? I'm in the hands of a devil. So this person is, the, is not the one I was looking for and you might panic all of a sudden it's like that you were sleeping till now with well, four of wands in reverse you need to look um you know look behind and you need to uh, see what's going behind your back okay maybe this person is promising a lot of things they are telling you a lot of things and all the things that they are telling you needs to be cross-checked so you need to turn around and check what is going behind your back. Maybe this person is not very sure about what they're saying. And uh, maybe you cannot rely on their promises. I'm not saying that you need to doubt this person. If you know that they are genuine, you can trust them. Of course, it's your relationship, but you know, I'm supposed to read my cards and these are like that. So with this four of wands, in reverse they can break this commitment or they are lying about something even if they are not going to break their commitment they are lying about something you need to check that before making a final commitment okay however this is a general reading this is not going to resonate for all and energy could be reversed as well also you can check your moon and rising sign um let's go ahead and check some more messages for you Messages for Pisces. Name of Wands.
four of swords. High Priestess, and a star, Knave of Wands. This person is a total player. This person is hiding a lot just because they want to be with you. They don't care how will you feel when truth will be revealed or what will happen next. All this person wants is to be with you. They are, you know, attracted towards your body maybe. This person wants to um, feel your body but I don't think that this person has deep emotional connection. At least till now this person hasn't developed this connection so strongly. This person is being selfish, they are self-centered. It's like I want spices at any cost. No matter how many lies I have to tell, no matter how they will feel tomorrow about me when everything is revealed, I just want to be with them somehow. I just need to be with them somehow. So this person is going to um, use a lot of tricks. They are going to do a lot of drama just to grab your attention. And then here you have Four of Swords. So Four of Swords is here. Looks like that um, you are not going to trust them immediately. But this Four of Swords, you already have a lot of experience. Nobody needs to tell you. They are dealing with a Pisces. And uh, with this Four of Swords, things might feel like uh, disappointing i mean you will feel attracted towards this person and then you cannot trust them this could be suffocating or this could be disappointing but at the same point you are smart enough to protect yourself and uh, then here you have um queen of cups this person cannot stop thinking about you for them you are something out of their dreams and uh, you are something unachievable. They take you as a challenge. They feel like that you are a trophy. And Queen of Cups can give them everything that they are looking for. In fact, you might be way better than them in comparison by looks, by money or by something else. So they are comparing themselves to you and they feel like that you are the right one for them. You can support them. They are being selfish. They are not opening about themselves and uh, the things that are going in their mind they are childish and uh, they are totally uh, you know carefree they don't care about tomorrow they want to live in present that's right but then you know things should be clear and uh, true but they cannot maintain this this kind of clarity in this relationship because they know that if you come to know something about them it will be over. Here we have the card of the High Priestess. This person is holding a lot of secrets. And uh, these secrets are something that you will not like. So they are well aware that if you learn about these things, you will walk away. Okay, maybe they have lied about their job, about uh, something else. And uh, about their past maybe. And you feel like if you come to know about those things, you will judge them. You will uh, compare yourself to them. And you will leave them for the good. Because they know that you can find someone better. Here we have the card of the star. They know that you are worthy of attention. You are admired and you can get anyone you want to. So this person is aware that you get a lot of attention and you can get anyone. That's why this person is, you know, doing such kind of things. Because they want to be with you at any cost. Let's check a message for you. Messages for Pisces. 
Pisces. A note on love. Seek different seasons and enter into the unknown. When love is the focus, foundation and goal, blessed is the body, mind and soul. So this card is telling you to step into the unknown. Maybe this person is unknown, but you need to know more about that. Okay, it's, I mean, I'm not telling you to stop this person um, from coming into your life. Of course, you should let them in your life, but with caution, you should know more about them. And uh, if you find this love attractive or real for, you know, at any cost, then of course it can be something that can bless your body, mind and soul. So it may differ in cases. So this was the reading for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.